We joined this event uh, because we've done many of these events and it has been such a successful partnership that we've had with, with, with CB Commerce. Um, each and every time we've met great retailers, we've met great new partners. Um, and actually it's got to the stage now that we really feel part of uh, CB Commerce and, uh, and, and the whole team. Uh, so, and so far this evening, what has been my best experience this evening? What have been my highlights? It's very simple. I was very flattered to be asked uh, to be part of the uh, CB, CB, uh, CB Commerce Marketplace Pitch Awards this evening. Um, and uh, so we stepped up, we prepared our pitch award, we came second but it didn't matter because what we wanted to do was introduce Frugo and at the same time have some fun and we hope that we managed to uh, introduce Frugo and let everybody know what we do and how we do it but did that in a fun manner and it was a really good experience to be up there um, and congratulations to the winner this evening. What are our cross-border challenges? It has always remained the same that actually selling cross-border does not need to be difficult but a lot of retailers, a lot of brands still see that uh, stepping outside of their domestic environment is something that, um, uh, that, that, that is uh, fringed and uh, has a lot of difficulties with it. Um, and at Frugo, we've made this whole process so very simple for our sellers. This is why that 93% of all of our sales are cross-border. We invest in our retailers, um, but still a lot of people, when we're, a lot of brands, a lot of retailers, when we're talking to them, still think there are many challenges there. And we try to take those challenges away. So it really is just explaining the simplicity of cross-border selling when it comes to Frugo.